Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Tuesday, 7th of March 2023. These trades were shared by SH who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average CFD using a Forex broker and 30 minute macro chart. He identified a very good downtrend pattern and using five minute structural chart, you can see the trading channel that is going down and the pullback got completed at this point and using one minute trading chart he identified multiple entry and exits that managed them very well and you see that all these trades that were sell shorted rich profit so thank you very much Sage, for sharing your trades with us the next trade was shared by Yasin who is trading S&P 500 and as you see the 10 minute macro chart is in downtrend uh, clearly and we see the price is now broken this level of support and you see with two minute structural chart the downtrend channel again with uh, pullback got completed so using tick trading chart he identified good entry here and entered two positions with tight stop loss and closed both positions using exit strategy two with profit so thank you Yasin for sharing your trade with us. The next trade was shared by AP who's trading Euro USD using Forex broker. He identified in four hours macro chart, a downtrend channel. It's kind of sideways pattern, but anyway, it seems that the price at this level of the dynamic support was broken. We see some shadow of pullbacks. We can see that the price pulled back in 30 minute chart that the channel broke here and this channel using five minute trading chart identified as a downtrend and he entered in very good area here after pullback and the sellers came back with a tight stop loss and now the stop loss is transitioned and past the break even to hold the profit now he is showing the management of trade tightening the stop loss to save more profit and has a target on the other side of uh, support just and just exit here with maximum profit so thank you very much ap for sharing your trade with us the next trade was shared by castro or global instructor who's trading dow jones industrial average in form of cfd using forex broker we can see that the price after reaching this level of the resistance couldn't hold it and the uh, sellers came back and the price broke here so this provided opportunity to enter with setup b with very tight stop loss and very good risk to reward ratio and as you see from this open trade the price reached almost the target so thank you very much castro for sharing your trade with us the next few trades were shared by yan or global instructor who is trading nasdaq futures and as you see the macro chart shows downtrend and the macro also of the 10 minute charts shows downtrend but there was a complex pullback here it's still leaning down using a two minute chart you can see the channel that is going down this wave and this wave of the downtrend was taken using a five second trading charts so two sell short position with exit strategy number one was closed with profit and this is the third one that is the last wave so the result of this trade shows profit factor cannot be calculated and is shown as 99 because we had 100% win rate but we can see that average winning trades were $61 and the largest winning trade was $125 so thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us the next few trades are those I have taken yesterday at the beginning of New York market session and the video was sent to students yesterday so I'm gonna replay the video for you Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that I have taken on Tuesday 7th of March 2023. These trades were taken on the Nasdaq and Russell futures derivatives and in form of E-mini and micro. And if you look at the macro structures from yesterday, price after hitting some high, the couldn't hold and got rejected and came back down and you can see that in a five minute chart the price at this point of control and close to previous day close 
uh, tried during Bolobek's time to broke this year, and also at the beginning of New York market session, but it couldn't hold and got rejected. At 10 o'clock then we had a uh, Fed testimonial, uh, so market is volatile and it dropped down. So what I did uh, this 9.30 when it opened here and retested this previous day close, this long candle was taken, uh, long positions, and then after that, when it got rejected at this point and went down in five minute charts, you can see that short positions were taken here. Uh, so this is a long position on 10 second trading chart against one minute and five minute, and this is a short positions. And also I took some uh, positions after the news and also uh, let this volatility pass and the price got rejected here. So I took long position on Russell that you can see here when the price got rejected at this point, which is the previous low and it's very good area of the uh, support for Russell. So the result of each of these trades were copied to multiple trading account by Apex and then summary shows profit factor of 2.76 with 70 to 94 percent win rate from long and short sides and average win to loss ratio close to one and the largest losing and winning trades were around 125 to 100 dollars so hope these trades taken by the path system for quick scalping is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.